Here's how you find seven eighths on a ruler or a tape measure. So the way to think about this, right down the middle, so this is zero to one, so that's one. If we cut it in half, we end up with one half. So this is our one half. If we cut that in half, we end up with one fourth. So we have our one fourth. Take that one fourth, cut it in half, and you get one eighth right here. So each one of these blocks here is one eighth and there are eight of them here in one. So we're looking for seven eighths. We'll go one, two, there's three eighths, four eighths, which is just one half, five eighths, six eighths, that's just three fourths, and there it is, seven eighths. So let's try this again on a blank ruler. So we know right down the middle we have one half, and if we cut our one half in half, we get one fourth. Cut that in half again, we get one eighth. And you could even go down to 1 16th here. We're looking for 7 eighths though. So 1, 2, 3 eighths, 4 eighths, 5 eighths, 6 eighths, right here, 7 eighths. If you kept going, you'd have 8 over 8, 8 eighths, 8 divided by 8, that's just 1. That's how you do it. That's how you find 7 eighths on a ruler or a tape measure. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.